from Glengarry and you're listening to Adelaide's 88.7 Coast FM. You are and we always thank you for doing so. So if you're like many people, you probably have a few old record albums lying around that you're not quite sure what to do with. So replacing your collection with CDs can be expensive and sometimes it's impossible because not everything is even available on CD. So if you are missing your old music and you wish to, you could hear it again, we may have the solution for you. And no, it's not about very complicated technology such as transferring your records to a digital medium. Caitlin O'Toole communications and engagement project officer from the Catalyst Foundation is here to talk to enlighten us about how to access a huge catalogue of music for free at the touch of a button. That sounds interesting. Caitlin, thanks. Thanks again for being with us. We say good morning, Caitlin. Good morning, Caitlin. Good morning, Ryan. Always a pleasure. How are you? Oh, good. How was your weekend? Good? Oh, it was wonderful. Thank you. It was so beautiful. Yes, yeah, nice to be in that cooler temperature, isn't it? It's nice to sort of think, okay, we don't have to sweat and swell out in the sun. It's just nice. This is my type of day, actually. I love it. Exactly. Me so, too. before we get into the topic, let's talk a little bit about the Ca- the Catalyst Foundation. Firstly, what it's, what it's all about, Caitlin? Sure. Um, Catalyst Foundation is a charitable, inclusive service and a leading provider of community information in South Australia. We focus on areas such as home support, aged care services, disability, housing, independent living, digital literacy, which is what I'll be talking about today, retirement living, and connecting people to services. Right. So you mentioned today we are going to be chatting with you about something very useful how to be able to listen to all your favourite old songs now for free without too much trouble. Well, that sounds almost like pirating, doesn't it? But but it's obviously it not. Hey, no, it's not. It's actually completely legal. And I'm a huge audiophile. I love music. When I was younger, I had a ton of records, everything from soundtracks to musicals to music from the 50s and 60s. And when technology moved on from vinyl to digital media, there was no way I could purchase my entire collection on CD and not completely go broke. (laughs) So, like, yeah, I mean, so like many people, I was at a loss. It seemed like all of my favorite old songs were gone forever because I couldn't access them anymore without purchasing expensive and complicated gadgets to transfer all the records to my computer, et cetera. Plus, it would take tons of time to do that. Yeah. So, so I have had the same problem. So, have a lot of pe- so have a lot of people that I know. So what what should we do to to change this? Uh... Well, my life seriously changed when I realized I could use an app, what's called an app, like Spotify, to yep. stream music for free. Yep. And streaming is kind of like borrowing the music from the library, it's, as opposed to buying the music. And so all of a sudden, I was hearing all of my favorite old songs again, and they sounded great because there were no, none of those cracks and pops that my dusty old records have. Um, so this year, Catalyst Foundation is a great lineup of useful webinars this year in which we'll explain how to, access, how to access millions of songs on Spotify right on your tablet, smartphone, or computer. Richard Pasco, uh, who's also known as the Adelaide Tech Guy, will be presenting with us on topics such as how to access and use Spotify and, and uh, even other streaming services such as YouTube and Netflix to get your fill of old music, movies, videos, concerts, and TV shows. Oh, for example, the other day I just happened upon really great footage on YouTube of the Beatles landing in Sydney in 1964. How cool is that? It's amazing to know that many of these incredible, fun historical events have been preserved online for forever. Mm, that's amazing. So, and these services are free. That sounds incredible, doesn't it? Many of them are free. Spotify offers a free service in which you can listen to music with the occasional advertisement, and YouTube has a free version as well, which enables you to watch millions of videos with with ads. But if you pay for the version, it comes with a few perks, such as no ads, which is really nice. Um, It's not that expensive, but we have a few... Yeah, I mean, we have a few webinars this year that will be of interest to people who love music. One of them is called Accessing Online Music and News, and that's on Tuesday, the 23rd of February. In that webinar, Richard Pasco will explain how you can hear all of those songs you thought you may never hear again for free. 
And then um, coming up in March on the 30th, Richard will also present a webinar if you enjoy our music webinar called Streaming Services Guide, in which he'll go over video sites like YouTube and Netflix, which is great for people who have dusty old copies of movies on VHS tapes that you'd love to watch again. So, how do listeners find out more about these events, uh, Caitlin? You can always give Catalyst Foundation a call at 08-8168-8776. You can email us at information at catalystfoundation.com.au or you can visit us on the web at catalystfoundation.com.au for more information. Now, if you're somewhat tech savvy, you can also do a search um, in Google for Richard Pasco. That's P A S C O E at eventbrite.com.au, and you'll be able to register for any of his events, which include webinars about the so called cloud, which may be confusing to a lot of people, smartphone hacks and tricks, which will show you how to do sort of different things with your phone that you never thought you could do, and how to make sure your digital footprint is preserved after you pass away. That's amazing. Well, the the Catalyst Foundation do terrific work, as I said earlier, and uh, this is just one example because, you know, as we get into that uh, baby or the baby boomer generation are not really as tax savvy, savvy as Generation X and whatever afterwards, but, you know... Coming along to some of these webinars, it would be such a great learning experience. And I would strongly encourage you, if you're thinking of, uh, you know, making life better for yourself, learning more, and learning more keeps the brain active and uh, helps along the way of all our health, I think. If we're happy in our, uh, in our being, we're obviously going to be healthier as well. So a great opportunity there to uh, get in touch with the Catalyst Foundation. And if they want to just give a phone call, uh, Caitlin, to uh, learn out a little bit more, can you uh, give us a phone number? Sure. It's 08 Eight seven seven six. People are friendly and really helpful. And also, I just wanted to add that the webinars are completely free. Yeah. So that's yeah. a beautiful thing. Yeah, that's fantastic. Well, thanks again for uh, sparing some of your Monday to be with us here on Coast FM. And we look forward to our next next topic next month. My pleasure, Roy. Thank you so much. Have a great day. You ha- you do the same. Bye for now. Okay. Bye.